Hey everyone, happy Monday. Thanks for watching Motivational Monday with Jay. I hope that each and every one of you all are safe in your homes, um, wherever your location is. I'm praying a prayer of protection over each and every one of your families that you are safe. Um, I want to also just encourage you all today to let you know that you are not an accident. You are not an accident. I'm going to say it one more time. You are not an accident. Now it's time for you to say it, that I am not an accident. Because it's important, yes, that someone else encourages you and can speak life into you. But also it's important that you speak life into yourself and to let yourself know I'm not an accident. Yes, my family may have rejected me and I've been in foster care and different things has happened and I was abused and a number of things has happened in your life, but you are not an accident. Things happen in this world because of sin, but God is in control. He's sovereign. And it's important for us to know that what we've gone through doesn't define us. What we've gone through doesn't mean that we are an accident. When we spill something, when a young kid spills something, when a child spills something, they're like, oops, because they're prone to make accidents and they're prone to say, oops, I wish I should have never done that. Sometimes we may get into a car accident and in their past and we're like, oops, I should have looked or oops, I, I, I hit this person's fender bender because I wasn't paying attention. But God never says that. God never thinks, oops, I should have never created her. Oops, I should have never created him. No, we were created in his image. And it's important that we understand who we are in Christ and that we know that you weren't created by an accident. You are not an accident. No matter what you've been through in your past, no matter how many people have rejected you, no matter what the college letter said that you weren't accepted into the school, you are not an accident. You are not an accident because your boyfriend or your girlfriend or your ex-husband or your ex-wife divorced you. You are not an accident. You are not a failure. You are not an ex. You are more than a conqueror. You are wonderfully and fearfully made. You are the head and you are not the tail and your latter, your future will be greater than your past. So hold on just a little while longer, hang on and don't give up. Now is not the time for you to give up. I just want to encourage whoever is watching, whenever you're watching, that you're not an accident. So now is not the time for you to give up. Now is not the time for you to throw in the towel. Now is not the time for you to say, oh, I'm not good enough. You are not an accident. Now is the time for you to get up, to hold your head up and not be prideful, but be confident and to say, I am not an accident. I know that this college may not have um, accepted me at this point in time, but I know that there's a college that I can get into. I know that there's a job for me. I know that there's a family that's going to accept me. I know that there's a, a career for my life. I know that there's something for me that God didn't create you just for you to struggle, just for you to feel as if you're a failure. No, 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 no. You are not a failure. You are a successor. You are a conqueror. So no matter what you're going through, no matter what it looks like or feels like, you are not an accident. So thanks for watching Motivational Monday with Jay. Have a great rest of your week. You are a winner. You are a conqueror. Keep going. And you are not an accident.